Hey everybody, I am going to test a Pinterest pen on how to clean retainers, how to get the crusty gunk off of there, how to get rid of all the staining. There has been a lot of gunk that has accumulated. You can see that right there. So there's all that gunk accumulating on my retainers and they have turned a beautiful shade of yellow. So I want to get rid of that. The first thing I want to do is get rid of that gunk. We need distilled white vinegar, warm water, and a toothbrush. I have all those ingredients, half a cup of water and half a cup of vinegar. I'm going to pour it into my little bowl here. And I'm going to put my retainers. And I'm just gonna let them soak. So I have been scrubbing this and you can kind of see that it looks a lot cleaner than it was before, but there is still some gunk on there. So I am going to repeat the process again and see how that goes. It has worked halfway. So let's see if it takes all the gunk off during the next try. I left the retainers in the mixture overnight because it was really, really crusty and it just wasn't coming off. Then this morning I checked them and all the gunk was gone. I did have to brush it a little bit. A nice light brush um, will work and it did get rid of all the junk. So everything else that you see in there, you see all that? That is the staining and that is what I am going to work on today. We need 50% um, water, 50% hydrogen peroxide, and a couple of tablespoons of baking soda. So I already mix up the mixture. I'm going to put the retainers in there and this should help with the staining. So there we go. And we're just going to let them sit. I think I need to flip it over so they can sink. Fill up with water and sink. So I'm going to leave it there. It says it can work within a couple of minutes or I'd have to leave it overnight and I probably am going to have to leave it overnight because this is like five or six years worth of staining. Hey everybody, the results are in. My retainers are now crust free. There is no crusty stuff on there. They have been completely removed and the staining was removed by about 95%. So I removed a lot of the staining, but it didn't take it completely off. I let it soak in the solution to get rid of the stains for three whole nights. So it took quite a while, it was quite a process, but that was six years of staining. So I think it did a pretty good job. I'm really happy with the results. They look so much better. The staining from the top teeth have been completely removed and this was the worst one and there's maybe about 5% staining left so there's not very much so I highly recommend cleaning with the solutions the one thing that people were talking about that was a big issue was the aftertaste of vinegar but I don't taste it. And I think it's because I did the crusty part first where you use the vinegar and then I let it soak in a second solution that does not include vinegar. And so that second solution that removes the stains, that took out that taste of vinegar. If that is a big concern to you and maybe you don't have staining, maybe just soak it in in that second solution to get rid of the stains just to get rid of that vinegar taste. So, um, like I said, I'm not, I don't have any issues with that. I'm pretty happy with the final results. And I was kind of concerned that letting it sit in the solution for so long was going to maybe weaken the retainers or the solution would eat through the retainers. And it did not do any of that. They are nice and strong. They're in great shape. They're cleaner. And I am very happy. There you go. There are the results. Please subscribe to my channel. And I hope you enjoyed this one.